Hey yo, Night Owls, my name is Knots, aka Mako, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Now, if you're watching this in the distant future, just uh, ignore the next message. This message is for people who are watching it as soon as I upload this video. If you're watching this, I apologize because in the next week, there won't be any Stardew Valley videos. And next week, I mean like six days because I will be back on Thursday, and for Friday, I will have another episode of Stardew Valley. And from then on, I will actually be making up all the episodes I missed. So that means you'll be getting two episodes per day up until I make up the five or six days that I don't upload anything. So yeah, I, I hope that's okay. But I will be uh, uploading a channel update video soon that will uh, highlight all that and give you more information about what's coming for the channel and for the series and basically everything else revolving this channel basically i guess that's a channel update isn't it well anyway let's get on to the day now we have to actually let me take the bigger stack we have to get our barn upgrade today and i think we still need like 15 so we need to go to the secret woods two more days to get all the hardwood we need for the next house upgrade now the weather report for tomorrow says it's going to rain all day tomorrow well, at least tomorrow is not the wedding day because that would be a sad, sad day. A sad, rainy wedding is not good. Fortune teller. The spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Well, I haven't really been to the mines lately and that's because there's just been way too many things to do. And there's still a lot of things to do, so the mines are just way out of the way. Welcome to Living Off the Lane. We're back again with another tip for y'all now. Listen up. I'm Spotlight, Crab Pot. Experienced anglers know how to craft crab pots. Despite the name, the pots can be used to catch a wide variety of aquatic critters in both fresh and salt water. Just place a crab pot in the water and load with bait. Come back the next day and check on it to see what you caught. You'll need to load it with bait again to catch more. That's what I keep forgetting to use. Now I know that I grabbed the crab uh, pot or just a crab, I don't know, like the shellfish profession. I don't know what it's called exactly. So should be able to make crab pots a lot cheaper, yeah. 25 wood and 2 copper bars, so that's pretty cheap. Let's actually start making some more copper bars, because I know I don't have that many yet. I only have 12. And I would like to get some more crab pots, just so that we can keep doing fishing that way. Since it doesn't seem like we're leveling up our fishing level too quickly, but I would love to. Right now we are at, that's the wrong thing, there we go. Fishing is 7, lowest level again, still. Combat is 8, other two things are 9, and then farming of course is 10. Uh, we're not working on mining. We're working on forging every now and again. But mining, hmm. We'll get those up there, at least before the end of year two. I mean, clearly before the end of year two. Let's collect this, and why does that look like it's almost done? Like, it seriously looks like it's just complete and ready to go. Did I do something to it that made it grow super fast? I don't think so, right? No, 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 it's not ready to go yet. Well, it just looks that way, apparently. Hey, Thor, what's going on, little buddy? What's going on? Yes, you're a cutie. Come on, Thunder. Let's go off and try to figure out if we have anything over here. Of course, Thunder's too fat and can't fit through most things, but that's okay. I, I love him just the same. Let's get in here and nothing. Well, okay, that's fine. We can just uh, do something else then while we wait for our coffee beans to grow in. And I guess just the coffee beans. We have other things to uh, wait to grow in. But these things aren't going to be done for a few days, it seems. We did plant them on the first. Are you kidding me? He fits. Okay, I was like about to get really mad because he fits going up, but he doesn't fit going down. Thunder, seriously, you keep getting caught on everything. That horse is super fat. Looks like the animals can get through the gate just fine. There's a the duck and there's a chicken over here just chilling out. I don't know what's wrong with these two. They're just like just chilling up here. I guess they like the hill instead of going all the way down here. Looks like the cow is beelining it for here. Yep, totally. The cow is just like heading right for this. <laughs> Right for the gate, and the cow can fit. Okay, that's what I wanted to check, because, I don't know, it seems like the horse is too fat for some of these things. Didn't know if the cow or the goat would be, but it seems like they fit just fine. So we'll leave them just like that. They have their own little area now, all fenced up in every which way. And we can take care of them just like that. I, I guess it's a little harder to actually, like, stop them, to milk them and stuff like that. Which is why I will always milk them before we actually open up the uh, their enclosures. So that's that's the thing. That's what I'm going to keep it as. Let's see. What else do we need to leave here? Obviously not that. We can make one more copper bar. And I guess the rest of them are going to have to be... Well, let me just grab that. The rest are going to have to be gold because I want to just keep on with using up all the ores in here. I don't want to have to keep ores just stocked in here for no reason. 
other than I was too lazy to get them going. And there we go. We're gonna have to make a lot of refined quartz. I don't know if we're actually gonna end up using it, but if we do, then yay. If not, then eh. Doesn't really matter so much. Now, we can actually head off to the secret woods, right? Right? It looks like we have everything done, so I think that's about the right time. No, 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 no. Nope, I'm gonna do this again. After I say I'm gonna do this thing, I'm going to go do that thing, right? Right. Okay, so I said I was gonna go to the secret woods, but then I keep forgetting that I mean to go to Robin's. And I keep forgetting to do it because I always say I'm gonna go do this and do something else, and I'm pretty sure I'm like going through some kind of weird circle right now that makes absolutely no sense. But yeah, going to Robin's first, then secret woods. And ooh, there's a tree here. This one still hasn't grown. Fishy. But at least this one grew, and I'll take the wood. Oh, there's another one across the way, too. Well, I'll take all the wood I can get, because I don't need to just upgrade the barn. I need to upgrade the freaking coop, too, and uh, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. If I end up with more than a thousand wood, even better, because I do need to make more crab pots, and ooh, why does everything need wood? This is why you need to make a proper tree farm, and I tried. I really tried, but I should have laid it out a little better. But I didn't really want to use so much space in my farm as a thing. Because if I did that, then I'd have, like, just trees everywhere. Oh! Just trees everywhere, and I don't know. Maybe I'll do it next time, because I have been collecting a lot of tree seeds. Like, obviously, I have, like, a billion and one pine cones. I've been selling them for the most part, but I still have quite a few. Yes, Robin, I do need something built, but first, can I buy... Whoa, okay, she has a lot of recipes. I was looking for two specific ones. I can buy some path ones because I do want to make paths. Beautiful, beautiful paths. Aha! This one, I want to make iron lampposts, so I'll take that and... Hmm... What the? A furniture catalog. Was this here before? I don't think that was here there before, but that's very expensive. We are halfway through getting it. Ooh, the plasma TV, we can actually afford this. I'd rather be using that instead of the crappy, what was it, the floor TV that we have? No, I think we have the budget TV, which... Wait, which one do we have? No, we probably have the floor TV, huh? Because it's cheaper. Let's see, do I want a stepping stone path or a crystal path? You know what? I'll get both, and then I will decide which one I want later. I mean, we can technically afford all these recipes, so let's just do it. There we go. It's not like we're using the money for anything else. And we can also get a calendar so that we can see where we're needed <laughs> basically if it's someone's birthday I, I would like to know maybe i might actually remember to give them something i don't know but yeah there we go we spent a little bit of money here we're gonna spend a little bit more money construction constructing a farm building we want the deluxe barn so it seems that we have everything this is oh yeah this is 500 wood should we get rabbits first i feel like it's uh that this one should go first before any other ones so rabbits huh Sure, I guess I'll upgrade the coop first then and do the barn tomorrow. I mean, I have more than enough stone for the stuff and I'm getting to the wood there, so sure, let's build. We want to upgrade, select the big coop to upgrade. Okay, okay, I'm getting there. Slowly and surely we're getting there. And there we go. So Robin's gonna be working on this coop to make it into a, what was it, supreme coop? No, I'm kidding, an ultimate coop, <laughs> ultimate coop. Let's see, what can we go do off- well, what can we go do now that we are done with buying stuff apparently? We just spent a ton of money on stuff that we probably didn't need, but we're not using that money really, so hey, why not? We're gonna make more money eventually anyway, because we- that's what we've been doing. We've been making all the money that we need for whatever it is that we need, and that's the way that this game is gonna work. We're just gonna make lots and lots of money and buy really expensive stuff, and I never really had like a really decorative house or anything like that but I kind of want to do that and I kind of want to make decorative sheds and stuff like that to make them like special different rooms but that's gonna come later on in the game because I would like to make things that are actually useful like a shed for kegs a shed for I don't know preserve jars things like that and like I'll put chests in each of them that have the proper produce so like if I have kegs in one room I'll have like coffee beans in the chest or oh this is a difficult tree to actually get isn't it or I'll have like pumpkins in the chest or something like that and just keep like tons and tons of stuff like that. Let's see if I can collect. Oh, I got two wood from that. Well, it's better than nothing, so whatever. Let's see if we can go find more trees because we do need another. Well, we need to get to 550. Oh, what the heck? That's not even the dirt that's in the grass. Do those even happen? Is this a bug or something? Uh, I didn't ever. I've never seen that before, Demetrius. 
Oh, Demetrius. Okay, let's see if there's any trees over here. And if not, I might be able to just check the the spa area. Well, I feel like I've chopped down the trees there recently. So maybe there's not going to be anything there at all today. Oh, actually, let me not cut into the void. Although it seems like this tree is in a dangerous spot. It could fall into the water or into the void. Well, we got all the wood, so it doesn't matter. Well, let's go find more trees because that's just what we need right now. We're headed to the secret woods in the dark of night. If that's not spooky, then I don't know what is. But we did get some more wood in the... It was around the fishing area, at the train area. We found just a few trees, and I mean, that's good enough for me. It did take a while to chop them down. Oh, look at that. There's another tree there. We are losing a lot of energy, though, by chopping down all those trees. So we have to be very, very cautious because I do want to maintain my energy in case I have to do anything else on the farm. I don't see any slime. Do slime sleep? This is a thing that I don't know. Do any of the monsters ever sleep, really? Ooh, is that anything ever anyone ever asked? Because I, I've never really thought of that. Oh. I guess la that slime's not asleep, and I don't see any other ones, though. So maybe the other ones do sleep, except for that one. Maybe they sleep in different stages. Like, what, like, you know how it used to be that there are, like, night owls and early birds, obviously, because back in the days when people were hunter-gatherers, they needed people to be up at different times of the day to make sure that their enemies weren't coming to steal their foods and all that kind of stuff. Well, maybe the slimes are just that way. I don't know. Maybe they are less evolved than the humans in this place. Maybe. Maybe not. We don't know. I don't think there's really a scientist studying the slimes, unless Demetrius is, but... Seems Demetrius is studying everything. He's just, he's too into everything and he needs to focus on something. Or maybe he is. I don't know. I never really talked to Demetrius much. Never really like saw his cutscenes or anything like that. I know he's like overprotective of his daughter and that's about it. Which makes me wonder why people aren't overprotective about Sebastian. I mean, he has two parents and a sister and why not Sebastian, right? Or is this just a, a I don't know. I'm not going to get into that type of stuff. Can I just not cut this down? What the heck? Okay. Ah, uh, that tree was a little weird there. I didn't think I would be able to cut it down, but suddenly... Oh, do not go in the water. Do not go... Okay, good. Well, now we have 373 wood, and we need less than 200 now. I wonder if there are any more trees around here. I know I can chop those logs, but that's a lot of energy wasted on just on hardly anything, really. Oh, can we make it? We are very, very low on energy right now. I thought that getting all those star drops would actually help, and I mean, it has. No doubt it has. But we need more. I should probably go and buy the one from Krobus because I, I don't think I bought it yet, right? I don't think I have. So I do need to go do that eventually. Now it's 10.50. I am down here cutting trees. I think I can make it up in time. I should probably leave at around 11.30 or something like that because we do have some cheese and eggs. Sorry, mayonnaise, not may eggs. It's, it became mayonnaise from eggs. What the heck? But we have some stuff to actually take care of so we can sell it. And really, we didn't make that much money today. I don't recall selling much of anything, so that's a big whoopsie on my part. But hey, we need 120 more wood to be able to get the big barn upgrade. Or it's not even big barn upgrade, is it? What is it called? Why well, can't I remember the name? Oh, there's another tree. Do not want to do that? Nope. I'm just going to get the rest of these trees. Oh my god, there's more. There's more trees everywhere. Trees everywhere, you guys. That's amazing. Okay, well, I'm, I'll get those trees tomorrow since hopefully the ones on the farm here will also be able to be harvested because there's still the little little trees in the way and i did get a few of them from there so that's not that bad we're getting better there we're getting through all the trees that are kind of sort of locked in with other trees now i do want to lock these kids in because i don't want them getting stolen i hope i sincerely hope that they're all inside it looks like they are i don't see anything out here so it seems like they just wrangle themselves into the the barn in the coop so i don't have to do that thank freaking goodness I don't know how I would go about doing that. Let's just close that up, and I'll leave the other one open, sure. I, d I guess it really doesn't have to exist, but I'll leave it there just because. Let's go in. Oh, I see honey. Oh, man, there's so much stuff to pick. Oh, my gosh. Okay, okay. Run, 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 run. I want to make sure I get everything today. It is already one, and oh, man, I didn't place these things down. Oh, well, too bad, so sad for me. I guess I can't do much with it. Um, That looks like it's about it. We can just like store that stuff in there. Oh, I didn't give one coffee away. I don't know why I didn't notice that. Okay, well, it's just, that's really too bad. I guess that's something that we're going to have to do tomorrow, since we do have to give other coffees away tomorrow anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, so I'm getting blue jazz honey and tulip honey, so it's definitely the one that's closest, like 100% closest. 
So it doesn't even matter that I planted them like that close together, like all of them like in one not three by three. It's just like the one that's immediately next to it. So obviously there's gonna be a tulip one and a blue jazz one. So I might want to remove the tulips because the blue jazz honey is no doubt worth a little more. At least I think that's the case. So I'm gonna check that in one second when we uh finish this day. Let me just put in some more eggs here. I for sure have time one two and i don't have milk extra milk so that's gonna have to just go unmade the cheese is have to go, gonna have to go unmade Alrighty, and now we can go to sleep good night though oh thor is by the bed oh hi thor do you want to snuggle tonight is that what it is you hear cute puppers go to sleep for the night yes and for the 11th of spring year two we have made three thousand three hundred and eighty seven gold um, let's take a look at this yeah the tulip honey is worth i mean it's not that much less but it adds up over time so we should probably remove the tulips and just keep the blue jazz for now i think that's what i'm gonna do for sure for at least for the next one and that mayonnaise is what's making us all the money that we're getting so we need to keep on going with that mayonnaise for sure for sure okay <laughs> i guess not well let's hang the calendar up somewhere now i do really want to change the colors of these walls and stuff like that because ugh, I, I swear let me like hang it up somewhere here are you kidding me why won't it like showed green once didn't it i swear it showed green oh it showed green i can place it on the floor must be placed on the wall okay well this is not a wall fine i'll place it right next to the bed how's that let's place it like down here that, that is a wall okay that's weird so tomorrow wait how is this gonna happen the wedding and the egg festival are on the same day uh what 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 I don't know how that's going to work, but I guess we're going to have to see what, what they do, because that's a little... It's weird. Hey, Thor, what's going on? It's raining, and that means that nobody's going to be out today, so we're going to have to actually, like, hunt people down to give them coffee. Like, yo, where were you? Here's your coffee. And they'll be like, oh, I don't ask for coffee. Oh, what are you doing, crazy person? It's going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the egg festival, and apparently the wedding. The event will take place in Pelican Town, starting between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m., unless the wedding ends up being on the 14th or something, and I miscalculate. I don't know fortune teller the spirits are somewhat annoyed you know what spirits just screw off okay just screw yourselves die in a fire or something like that you guys clearly do not like me dear Mako, tomorrow we'll have an egg vessel in the town square you should arrive between 9 a.m 2 p.m if you'd like to attend you don't want to miss the annual egg hunt mary lewis yeah mary lewis we already know we already know oh i need to place on a new tv let me do that I, I don't know. Yeah, we have the floor TV, which is rather unfortunate. Let me just, uh, how can I select it? Is there a way to select it? Oh, there we go. I was just like, uh, <laughs> how do I grab this? I don't know how to TV, apparently. Oh, my gosh. Um, that's freaking massive. <sighs> Let's get rid of that, then. And we're going to have to put that somewhere else, because this TV is... <laughs> oh, Jesus. I did not expect that to be that big. I freaking forgot. Let's just place that there. Well, massive TV is massive, and it's taking up basically the entire living room. So we're going to have to <laughs> just deal with it, apparently, since we bought it, and we can't really return it. Ooh, I think these are the last two eggs that we have, which is both, ooh, yay, we finally use them all, and oh, no, now we're not going to have any money from that. Let me store this TV in here, since I don't think we're going to, or at least Robin won't be available, actually, since she's working on our coop, right? Or does she not work on rainy days anymore? I don't know. Let's go, Thunder. Time to get the day up and rolling. Whoops. We ran out of hay, so I've been just harvesting this grass because, 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 because clearly we cannot leave the animals out today. It's raining a lot, and uh, the animals would not like it outside. They would be super mad at me if I just, like, told them to, hey, get out of here. Go and chill outside, and they would just be like, and I'm just like, um, because that's where you belong. But no, nah, no, nah, I am not rude. I am not mean. I love my animals. They are fluffy and nice and clean. And I was trying to rhyme that, but it really didn't go. So, oops. Let's just uh, get some more mayonnaise going here so that we can actually keep making some money from that. Because we just have not been able to make any money whatsoever. And we did eat some green beans today. Green beans are hardly worth a dang thing. So I'm just going to store them away. And, I mean, if anybody asks for them, hey, I'll have green beans. If not, then meh. I can always turn the strawberries into more seeds. And I think that's what I'm going to keep doing. I did turn the regular, no normal quality ones into seeds. And I got like five seeds from the two that I put in. I can't remember. 
But I probably talked about it before because it was, I don't know, it was pretty interesting to me. Oh, actually, let me go back in there. I do have some things to file away, so let me do that. Let's just file away all these things here. We have 493 wood. We need another 57. So we're actually pretty close to our goal there. And that's not bad. Wow, the seed maker just goes really fast. We got three seeds from that first one, which is actually good. Now we have eight strawberry seeds total, which, I mean, we're going to be able to plant those soon. I know I can plant them now, but I'm going to hold off on that because we don't really have the room for them to grow right now. Uh, I mean, we do. Not on the farm. Kind of, sort of. There's some room in the the thing, the greenhouse, but it's not enough room for them to really grow. Like once I take down, once I start taking down all the uh, the coffee beans, then we'll have enough room for them. And now we have more seeds. That was just a single seed. Come on, that was rip off. That was a, such a rip off. Oh well. Oh, we'll be able to do something with these soon. Soon enough, I hope. And unfortunately, it's not raining today. Ooh, I forgot that I can make mead. I don't know why I didn't think about that. Oh, every time I say mead, it makes me think of someone else who I've been watching. Uh, another YouTuber I've been watching lately, Northern Lion, uh, keeps talking about this Hearthstone reference. And I don't know if you've been watching the Ultimate Chicken Horse or if you know about that game. But if you haven't, go watch Northern Lion series because it is hilarious. Just so, so funny. It's not like me to really be uh, selling another channel here, but I just I find it so entertaining. And yeah, why not? Why not? Let's just uh, finish chopping down the trees here. We probably, I said we need 57, so now I need just 17 more, you guys. Oh my gosh. We're getting there pretty fast. So it's good that there's just tons of trees around. That just makes me super excited. And uh, I don't know, we're, we're going to get everything that we needed right now. Right now. Right, Emily? Right, Emily? You want a coffee? Have I already given you plenty of gifts? Oh, we've already given her a lot of gifts this week. Well, see, this is going to be the thing. We have to find people who we haven't gifted enough gifts to just yet. Didn't mean to search in the trash. That's a very badly placed trash can because I just keep hitting it. And then if someone's around, I'm kind of screwed. Apparently, it's really hard to please Haley. We have just zero hearts with her. and we, I think we gave her a birthday present last year, didn't we? So she should love us, but she just doesn't. I think Kent's in here. Kent should be in here. Vincent's in here, but I'm not going to give him a coffee unless I want him to hate me. And wait, how many bedrooms are there in here? Jody, we still have three hearts with. There's one, two, three. But why is that a single bed? Where does Kent sleep? Does he sleep there? I'm pretty sure he probably sleeps there. Or on the sofa. I think the sofa would be more comfort comfortable. Comfy. Hey, Leah. Leah. <clears throat> I'm glad you like it. We have one heart with you. I don't know if that's how it was before, but I guess that is. Maybe we should cook something new and exciting today. Something spicy. Do you like spicy foods? Or is that? Are you hinting at me right now? I think she's hinting at me, you guys. Leah wants spicy foods. Well, sorry, Leah. All we have for you is coffee. So, womp womp. Let's go and check the traveling cart before we go into the secret woods because the traveling cart may have something useful. I don't know if it's gonna, but it might. So we, we can always check that out. Every time we're going by here, we can check it out. Mead. Hey, there's some mead right there. Fermented beverage made from honey. That's an expensive mead. I don't think it's worth that much at all. You can get some pickles, some tulips, spicy eel, grape starter, basic fertilizer, bread. Mmm, bread. I have garlic. I have large eggs. Very rose. I mean, if we could just, like, plant that, just like as it, as it is, then I would totally get it. But you can't do that. Luxury bookcase. I don't think so, lady. I don't think that's going to match my, like, my house. And freaking creepy noises all the time. Anyway, let's go and chop down our massive stumps over here. And, Wow. I like how the range has stopped. And murderize these slimes because if these slimes are holding my dwarf scroll hostage, I need it right now. Slimes, I am not messing with you anymore. I need this. I want this. It is my duty. It is my destiny to have that dwarf scroll and you will not hold it hostage from me any longer. Now give it to me or else I will decimate your populations over and over again. And that's pretty much what I'm doing anyway, so... You're gonna die one way or another, so just hand it over. What? Oh, oh, there's another one. I was just like, what's going on here? There was another slime there. Somehow I missed. Okay. And I see more slime there, but I uh, doubt it's going to have anything. You guys, what do we do? What do we do? We need that dwarf scroll to be able to actually talk to the dwarf. And these slimes are just not complying. So, what do we do? 
Looks like all the trees in this area have actually grown up. So we're just chopping everything down, basically, so that it can grow up again later on because we need all the wood right now. We're just hogging all the wood that we can find immediately. And I know, it's been like a few days of just getting wood and doing mostly nothing else. And that's, that's how... Just, that's how important wood really is to this game. Wood is like the single most important res resource, or resource, I don't know how you say it. But uh, if you thought that maybe coal was the most important resource, eh, wrong. If you thought maybe copper or iron or gold was the most important resource, eh, 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 wrong, wrong, wrong. It's, it's wood. Wood is what you need to build like most of everything. Oh god, I just lost some wood into the water, great. Wood is so necessary that that's why it's so important that you actually get your own tree farm. And speaking of tree farm, I just realized that I forgot to go and buy fruit trees. It's a little too late for that now, so we're going to have to do that on the 14th. Not tomorrow, but on the 14th, because tomorrow is the day of the egg festival and or wedding. Or both. Well, I said and or, so I guess that counts for both. Huh? Yeah, I'm a little tired right now, so I'm just like, eh... What is English? Let's see, do we have anything growing over here? I don't see anything over there to harvest. Let's check in here. I haven't checked in here in a little bit. Yes, we have a few seeds to harvest here. Whoa, okay, more than a few seeds. We need better lighting in here for sure. That's kind of why I wanted to build the iron lantern, but unfortunately, we don't have very many iron bars, so building the iron lantern is a little... I don't know, it's, it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. So we're going to have to wait until we collect enough iron all over again so that we can actually start making an iron lantern. But, you know what? We're collecting these beans anyway, so it doesn't even matter. We can see as as, so as soon as song as we are. Yeah, as soon as we walk into them because we have this beautiful little glow ring. I just wish I could find a regular size glow ring because that would make everything around me even brighter. Like, it would just make the circle a little bit bigger here. So we'll be able to see more around us. And that would be actually really, really good. But hey, just like that, the Midnight Tower is upon us. Just like that, you guys. Man, this day goes by quickly. Oh, I see that. I see that. Uh, I almost call it Pine Tower. That oak resin over there. I'm not going to miss you, oak resin. I will get you. Now, let's sell all of our forgeables. I have plenty of spring onions, so I can just sell that. I feel like I could sell that too, but I don't really want to. And uh, final wood count, we will do that in a second. So now I need to put in some more eggs here. I have two of our brown eggs here. Bloop, bloop. Did I collect everything that was in here? Ooh, seeds. More seeds. I'll take that. So we got three plus three plus one. We got seven total seeds from the three strawberries that we put into the seed maker today. That means we have a grand total of 12 strawberries from the probably five or six strawberries that we put in the thing. Which is actually not that bad. I'm quite pleased with it. At least, you know, for now. I kind of want to check the production in the barn. What did we just pick up? Oh, Crescent, yeah. I want to check the production in the barn because if there's anything done, I would love to sell it for the money immediately. 12.30. Okay, we can do this. We can do this, right, Thunder? We can. We got this. We got this even though there's like a billion fences in our way. Okay, apparently there was one fence in our way and it was already open. Okay, we do have something to collect here. It's pickled corn. It's not that much, but we'll put in more later and I guess I can harvest it. God damn it, I put the freaking coffee beans in the chest already. Okay, I'll leave the coffee there then. And I will just sell the pickled corn because that would be a little bit of money. It's not that, like, it's not great money, but it's okay. It works. And it's 1 a.m., so that means that tomorrow we won't have uh, the ultimate amount of energy, but that's okay. We can always eat stuff and be merry from that. Let's just plop some stuff in here. All right, so final wood counts. We have 709 regular wood and 159 hardwood, which means that we can do two upgrades now. And we have all the money that we need for it, too, so we don't have to collect any more money. We have all the stone, all the wood, everything. So in the next episode, maybe, hopefully, we will buy our house upgrade instead of the, the coop upgrade. And then after the house upgrade is done, we will buy the coop upgrade, and... Well, I guess that's, that's going to be it. Then we'll use the rest of the wood to make crab pots and everything else that we need to get production rolling even further. Go to sleep for the night? Yes. And for the 12th of spring year, too, we didn't make that much money, but whatever. I wasn't really after the money. It was more after the wood than anything else. So I'm quite pleased with how much wood we got, especially now that we can upgrade the two things that we've been chasing after. So I'm a happy bun. <laughs> Another bun. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. 
What? The wedding happens earlier than the egg festival. When Malco first arrived in Pelican Town, no one knew if she'd fit in her community. In with our community. But from this day forward, Malco is going to be as much a part of this town as any, any of us. Am I not wearing a nice outfit? Excuse me, why do I not get a nice outfit? It is my great honor on this day, 13th of spring, to unite Malco and Shane in the bonds of marriage. I'm wearing the same thing I wear day in and day out, especially my douche cap. I should probably not be wearing my douche cap for the wedding. Well, let's get right to it. <laughs> God, it looks terrible. Michael, Shane, as the mayor of Pelican Town and regional bearer of the matrimonial seal, I now pronounce you wife and husband. You may kiss. Oh, What are Vincent and Jazz doing? Oh, is everybody like dancing or something? What? Oh, look at Marnie. She's like just celebrating there. An old man is not even doing anything. He's just sitting there in his wheelchair, just looking. I, I we couldn't really tell, tell us from his face, but he's probably like looking really grumpy since we don't we're not even friends with him yet. I don't know why I haven't befriended him yet, but I should. Life is going to be different from now on. That means that we're going to have Shane around, but the future looks bright. That it does. Are we gonna wake up with Shane in our house or something? Game. Oh, well, we got kicked out of the house because Shane is probably inside. But anyway, that is it for this episode of Stardew Valley. Oh, there's Shane in the background. Wait, what is he doing? What is he doing? He has like a little egg chicken thing over there and he's like humping a chicken. No, I'm kidding. He's like rocking a chicken or something like that. I don't know. He's weird. But anyway, that's it for this episode of Stardew Valley. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button to share support and subscribe because I will have another Stardew Valley episode for you in six or so days. But yeah, for sure it will be uploaded on Friday, the next episode. I apologize again that there won't be an episode sooner, but I, I tried. I really tried. And I will detail that in the upcoming channel update video. And as always, thank you so much for watching. And have an awesome night.